Don't kill us, Max. I guess I'll never dance again, Max. Right when I was about to start a new life in California. I was happy just being your friend. Honey, I always thought of you like a Why daughter. do you want all your friends to die? Breaker, You're gonna breaker. Take me away. Thanks for saving my me. My husband and new baby. Carrying the load. Good Don't let the squirrels die. Big ten four. I thought you were one of the few people I could trust at Blackwell. Don't let the squirrels thought, die. I guess my husband and new baby. Breaker, breaker. We'll have Thanks to for saving me. So this I is how Max gets her revenge. Oh, That's a big Max. I was happy just being your friend. I guess I'll never dance again, Max. Why would you do that? I know things were bad between us, but that doesn't mean I deserve to die. I was happy just being your friend. Why do you want all your friends to die? Like a daughter, Max. Please so this is how Max break gets her revenge. Yes, Thanks for saving me. I know baby. I haven't yeah. carried well, the load. Don't let squirrels die. But friends, you who, great. who are you? Holy shit! Are you cereal? I'm you, dumbass. Or I'm one of many Maxes you've left behind. Can you get me out of here? Oh, so you want help? <laughs> Thought you could control everybody and everything, huh? Twist time around your fingers. I tried to help. I only wanted to do the right thing. No, you only wanted to be popular. And once you got these amazing powers, your big plan was to trick people into thinking you'd give a rat's ass. I do care. That's why I was trying to make friends. By telling people what they want to hear? <laughs> you were just looking for a shortcut because you can't make friends on your own. That's not true. I have great friends, and I've used my powers for good. Please, stop playing innocent. You're a goddamn hypocrite. You've left a trail of death and suffering behind you. That was not my fault, you son of a bitch. Don't you dare talk about our mom that way. <laughs> what about the crap that was your fault? Wait, wait, let me guess. You fucked up time and space for your precious punk, Chloe. <laughs> you think she's worth all that? This has to be my destiny to save her. I wouldn't be trapped in here if I didn't believe that. No kidding. Chloe trapped you with her drama. Guns, drugs, Rachel. Even stealing money from the handicapped fund. She's just using you, dude. Like, she even asked you to end her life and do what she couldn't do by herself. Chloe does a better job of guilt-tripping me than you do. Because you let her bully you. It's called Stockholm Syndrome. But you didn't do that homework, so you'll have to learn the hard way. Like Rachel. Just shut up. You're not scaring me anymore. I'd be more worried about Chloe killing us than Jefferson. Max. Do you really think she has any feelings for us? You're just another puppet. Man, you are so stupid. <laughs> I'm embarrassed to have the same name. And someday Chloe will destroy... Oh hell, speak of the devil. Dude, do not even fuck with her head. She knows what we went through together this week, and you don't. There's no way you can break up our team. This is reality. After five years, you're still Max Caulfield. I am seriously glad to see you. Welcome home, Max. Fasten your seatbelt. I uh, know it was your birthday last month. This was my real father's camera. This song fucking rules. Can't dance, hippie? Come on. Rock out, girl. You, you were here today, Max. You saved me. I'm still tripping on that. Seeing you after all these years feels like... Destiny. Let's talk about your superpower. Epic. Welcome to American Rust, my home away from hell. Ra and Ra. You saved me again. Crazy. Now we're totally bonded for life. 
Since you're the mysterious superhero, I'll be- I'm so glad you're my partner in crime. As long as you're my partner in- Max, you better come check out these files. It's not a draw. Cowabunga! Why look and- Let's call it a draw. I'm gonna freeze my ass off when I get out. Photo bomb! Photo hog. I double dare you. Kiss me now. Damn, you're hardcore, Mac. Oh, we could cruise everywhere in this bad boy. Can you see us heading down the coast of Big Sur and beyond? Not until I see it first. You know the rules, Dad. Dude, I am so lucky that my father... It's weird hanging out with you again. I know. I'm glad we are, though. Oh, awesome picture. We look so badass in our fiery... Chloe, you're back. I'm just... Kate wasn't the first. All those binders are... Rachel! Oh, Rachel, no, no! Please, not her! Chloe... <laughs> Come on, Max, we're almost there! We're almost there! Please, wake up! Wake up! Max, come on now! Don't worry! Don't worry! We'll be okay! Can you hear me? Please say something. Chloe, I, I must have passed out. Oh, thank sure. God. Don't you ever do that again, okay? I swear. But that nightmare was so real. It was so horrible. the only way. I feel like I took the shot a thousand years ago. You... You could use that photo to change everything right back to when you took that picture. All that would take is for me to... to... Fuck that. No. No way. You are my number one priority now. You are all that matters to me. I know. You prove that over and over again. Even though I don't deserve it. I'm so selfish. Not like my mom. Look what she had to give up and live through. And she did. She deserves so much more than to be killed by a storm in a fucking diner. Even my... My step... Father deserves her alive. There's so many more people in Arcadia Bay who should live. Way more than me. Don't say that. I won't trade you. You're not trading me. Maybe you've just been delaying my real destiny. Look at how many times I've almost died or actually died around you. Look at what's happened in Arcadia Bay ever since you first saved me. I know I've been selfish, but for once... I think I should accept my fate. Our fate. Chloe. Max, you finally came back to me this week, and you did nothing but show me your love and friendship. You made me smile and laugh like I haven't done in years. Wherever I end up after this, in 
whatever reality, all those moments between us were real. And they'll always be ours. No matter what you choose, I know you'll make the right decision. Chloe, I can't make this choice. No, Max. You're the only one who can. Max, it's time. Chloe, I'm so, so sorry. I, I don't want to do this. I know, Max, but we have to. We have to save everybody, okay? And you'll make those fuckers pay for what they did to Rachel. Being together this week, it was the best farewell gift I could have hoped for. You're my hero, Max. It's cool, Nathan. <laughs> Don't stress. You, you're okay, bro. Just count to three. Don't be scared. You own this school. If I wanted, I could blow it up. <laughs> you're the boss. So what do you want? I hope you check the perimeter, as my step-ass would say. Now, let's talk business. I got nothing for you. Wrong. You got hella cash. You don't know who the fuck I am, or who you're messing around with! Where'd you get that? What are you doing? Come on, put that thing down! Don't ever tell me what to do! I'm so sick of people trying to control me! You are going to get in hella more trouble for this than drugs! Nobody would ever even miss your punk ass, would they? Get that gun away from me, psycho! Hola. 